What up? This your man, Dante, back with another hot Akai NPC Renaissance tutorial um, and software recommendation. Um, I want to talk about, there's been a lot of speculation about Nexus, the VST. A lot of people said they had trouble um, installing it on the Mac platform. Um, this video is to show you that you can install it. Um, and they can see it's, it's up there. Um, to uh, change the GUI, um, because I know like sometimes you may see Nexus in black and white and all that stuff. You just go right here and hit Systems, and you go on here GUI Scan, and you just choose which one. Now you can buy, I believe you can buy custom ones. Um, I'll do another tutorial about that. Um, but this is pretty much how you do it. As you can see, it's work. You know, I bought it probably like a year or two ago. Um, and it... You know, they, they got a lot of famous sounds. Um, like this bell. Um, you hear that a lot. Especially, you heard that a lot. Um back in the um, Lex Luthor trap days. Um, but it's a decent plugin. Um, like I said, I usually, I'm more on hardware, but I do keep up to date with all the plugins and things of that nature, and it, it's a good plugin. It works. It also works in VIP software as well. So you can use the um, VIP features with that. But um, that's how you change the interface. Um, it's best if you guys like start buying the original. Um, I know a lot of people be hacking and downloading and cracking them and stuff like that. But you're not going to get the updates. You know, the necessary updates to run with your system. Like even when I when I bought this years ago, they didn't have all these different type of options for the GUI. I think they only had like four of them. But as I kept getting the updates, I kept getting more. So... This is pretty much how you do it, you know. Um, it's a good plug-in. Hopefully, Akai, if, uh, if any Akai personnel is listening, I would love for 2.0 eventually uh, have that GUI to, to change, the, the graphic user interface. You know, um, the one that they have now is decent. But eventually, you know, if Akai is out there listening, when 2.0 drop, um for a future update, give us the option to change the GUI, the graphic user interface. Um, maybe even customize it, you know, because eventually, you know, people's gonna get bored with that new, uh, with the new look. So, just give us a way that we can customize them, you know. It doesn't have to be too extravagant and things of that nature. Um, but this is it. This is Nexus. You know, it's a decent V60, I make some nice songs, but you're not really going to get the most out of it if you don't really know how to play, you know what I'm saying, like, we can choose a sound, just a basic sound, let's go up here, let me, that's basic sound, but if you don't know how to, do a demo version but this is how you do it you know nexus you know you got to get it you got to get it peace